important thing or things people need to know when selling to women that there are those subtle differences between male and female buyers, specifically the amount of purchasing power that they control, over $12 billion in purchases annually in North America, and also driving over 85% of all purchasing decisions within a family. Also recognize that women do not like a salesperson that is too aggressive. They want to have a trusting and very deep relationship and they're very concerned about the details when selling to women. When it comes to the automotive industry specifically, women like to buy from businesses and individuals that are socially conscious. They like and value trust in the relationship. They're not interested in a one-time transaction. They're interested in a long-term purchasing relationship. They like coupons, they like a deal, but they also like information and a sales professional or an organization in the automotive industry that really knows what they're talking about. Deep and steep technical information. Social media is very important when reaching out to female buyers. Uh, as you know, we're getting away from laptops and desktops. It's all going mobile. So if they have a need at that specific time for an oil change, a new set of tires, transmission, etc. They're searching locally on that mobile application, so businesses in the automotive industry need to promote and ensure that they have a presence on social media. It's very important to customize your retail automotive facility to the female buyer for a number of reasons. Ensuring that the restrooms are clean, the showroom is clean, that you have magazines and periodicals that attract and are interesting to the female buyer, that the retail frontline customer facing individual is well-groomed, professional, and is trusting and authentic. I think those are the most important aspects.